war zone. Expanding the culverts. Got my man on the machine. Good morning with the war zone. Still gotta do all this. Start to see where it's really nice over there. Sorry for the wind, but it's very smooth, which he's already done all that over there. Finishing up over here and widening the culvert so I can pull in just a little bit wider over here before my electric gates go in. Edge in here, and this will all flatten out once the roller comes and pounds all over. Over here on the Y. Got my buddy over there edging. Got the bobcat out here today. And then in my last auxiliary driveway here in the back. Park a trailer, maybe my truck. I don't know. Something back here. We'll see what uh we'll see what I feel like putting back here. Came out pretty awesome. Got it all wet here so it can be compacted. And I got up really, really close up here with the concrete. So I'm gonna get real close with the machine. Eh, a couple little chips right here on the corner, but ain't nobody bitching about that. Overall, it came out awesome. Couldn't ask for anything better. Then, over here, ask what I'm gonna do over here. Well, by code, I gotta have some sod and stuff, so... And there's not really much to do, and I thought about making all this millings, but it's too steep to really park anything but a car. So it's kind of just nothing, so this will all get sodded, and this will all get sodded back here, and I'll probably end up putting a, a garage door to the back here or something, and then just have extra storage in the back here. Came out good. So I gotta hurry up and get the side of my run away or run out, wash away, whatever the hell it's called is uh, happening. And that'll be cool. The driveway is officially done. The rain will cure all the asphalt here shortly. And it is all going to be good. If you want to know, like I said, my trailer is 48 feet and it is over there and it will look small over here. That is my shop and it is 60 feet and that's how small it is according to the driveway. Oh, yeah. 